I love this song, dude. I love this track, dude. All right, guys, and welcome back to more Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations. We are back, and we are about to talk to Laurice, Mr. Laurice Danum. I don't know what the hell his name. Uh, his name isn't Laurice. We all know him as Larry, but I don't know why he called himself Laurice Danum. But anyway, here we go. I'm pretty sure that's not how you pronounce the last name, but I don't know, man. I don't know how to pronounce the last name. So what are you doing with the last name Danum? Well, I just, I just wanted to start all over again with a clean slate. Oh yeah, right. A clean slate, huh? You remember, don't you, last time? The security, the master mask case. After that, I started to realize I didn't like this guy known as Larry Butts. And that's when I came across it, the Book of Destiny. The Book of Destiny, do you mean the magic bottle by Miss Elise Dana? It's so beautiful, so moving, so gentle. My heart felt cleansed. I was saved. Maybe I should buy a copy of the magic bottle. Larry would make a great book salesman. I really want to get that book now, too. Elise, tell me about Elise. She's the most wonderful person I've ever met. I'd follow her anywhere. Well, she certainly is a very elegant lady. You see? You see? Here's a photo I took of her in secret. In secret, she's looking dead at the camera, bro. That's a beautiful photo. You want a copy, don't you? That's okay. I just happen to have made extra prints. Photo of Elise added to the court record. Oh, no. Why are they giving us photos of Elise? No, she better not be the next victim. A photo. We just so happen to come across a photo of Elise. Oh, my God. If you have any foresight, when they start giving you evidence of a picture of someone, oh, God. Still, it's kind of hard to imagine you as a picture book illustrator. To tell the truth, you must have had some kind of ulterior motive, right? What are you talking about? I don't... I don't trust anyone anymore, especially not women. Oh boy. Talk about a bad case of denial. Anyway... It's the butts. It's the butts. It's the butts. <laughs> Can you even draw well enough to make a picture butt? Art isn't only about technical skill, you know. It's also about having a pure heart. And that's why I'm asking. Can you draw well enough to make a whole book? <laughs> hey, bruh. That's his bruh face. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I wonder. Looks like you still have some doubt in your heart. It's true, I do. But when I first saw her, I felt it. Something that saw me end it and something else began. Oh, Larry, it sounds like you've fallen in love with Miss Elise. No, you're wrong. It's not her, it's the other girl. Oh, he's talking about Iris. I got a bad feeling about this. Or maybe Miss Bikini. <laughs> Love this song. This track is awesome. I guess we have to present Iris to his face. <laughs> maybe it's Bikini, though. She seems really motherly, doesn't she? What do you mean, seems motherly? She is my mother. She's your what? I'm gonna have to take a pass on answering that one. Wait a second. Why is he getting off so easy this time? What the? That's his mom? <laughs> she is my mother. What? Unless he became a nut. Wait, how? What? I'm so confused. Ooh, yeah. Her. My little Iris. She's really pretty. This girl. She's perfect. She's exactly my type. I wonder if she would model for me. I want to draw a portrait of her. Yeah, you always liked those model types, didn't you, Larry? Hey, wait a sec. Didn't you say you were swearing off, woman? Huh? Yeah, that's right. Of course I have. I have, basically, but... 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 Iris is different. I feel like... I feel like I still have one chance left at the dream, but you know she's a nun, right? This guy will never change. Everyone! 
Din Din's ready, right? Hey, Pearly. Dinner preparations are complete. Please come quickly to the main hall for the feast. Oh, I can't wait to dig in, Pearly. I'm going to go to the inner temple and call Sister Iris. I also want to have a look around where Mystic Maya is going to have, or is going to be training. All right. See you later, Pearly. 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 February 7th, 7.46 p.m. Hazi Kure Tempo Main Hall. Let's go. Time to eat. Boy, am I stuffed. I'm not stuffed. I'm still hungry, and I'm the narrator. Y'all should have gave me some food. Are you sure it's alright to eat that much before your training? Oh, this kind of training is a battle of endurance. Mystic Maya, please don't do anything that might put your health at risk. Ah, ha, no pain, no gain, I guess. Mm, I'm still worried about you. Well, 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 let's not dilly dally shilly shally. You must get ready for tonight. Good luck, Maya. Alright, here I go. I'll see you all tomorrow, I guess. Iris, please ring the bell at 10 for lights out, alright? Yes, Sister Bikini. And then after you ring the bell, I want you to come join us at the training hall. I understand, Sister Bikini. Sister Bikini. Maya and Bikini really seem excited about this training thing tonight. Well, Pearl, what are you going to do tonight? Well, um... If you like, you can come to my room. Perhaps we can read some books together. Really? I love to. Uh, I'm not re very good at reading. Well then, would you like to practice reading with me? I love to. Pearls is absolutely smitten with Miss Dano. Danum. Dunu. Dano. I don't know. <laughs> so, Larry, what are you going to do? Huh, me? Man. I'm just gonna hang out in my room. I can't stand the cold. I totally hear you there, bro. Miss Lee, so for example, how do you read this? It says gravely. It's kind of a tough word. Gravely. Okay, and what about this word? That's another tough one. It says roast. Wait, did what kind of book is she reading anyway? I'm going to go wash the dishes and help clean and then learn how to <laughs> gravely roast your boy Nick. <laughs> She's going to learn how to roast Phoenix. She's going to be like, bring that ass back here, boy. I'm about to roast you. <laughs> there was well, not much to do except head over to my room and hu uh, huddle under the covers. <laughs> February 7th, 9-12 p.m. Hazikuro Temple. Main Hall. Ugh! It's a whole different type of cold up here in the mountains. Why couldn't the nearest bathroom be just a little close to my room, damn it? Mr. Wright? Yeah! Oh! Miss Dana! Are you going to use the bathroom too? <laughs> no, but uh, have you seen Pearl? No. Not since after dinner. I thought she said she was going to go to your room. I know, but she never showed up. I'm going to go look for her. Excuse me. Oh man, maybe we should help. Miss Elise. A woman as mysterious in the origin as her last name. But... The real mysterious one is... Iris. Oh! Sister Iris! Iris! No, this can't be happening! <laughs> what am I fighting for? <laughs> the real mysterious one is this girl. Are you on your way to the bathroom too, Mr. Wright? I can't let this chance pass me by. I should try to talk with her and maybe get some answers. What the? She's got black hair. What the hell? This is not what I was expecting at all. Unless she dyed her hair black. Um, your sister... Iris, right? Yes. So, um, when did you come to Hazekuri Temple? Why are you blushing, too? I don't remember. Ever since I was a small child, the temple has been my home. So you've never left? Well, I don't have any family left to take care of me. Sister Bikini, 
I've come to think of her as my real mom. Really? I see, but you... Did you go to college? And maybe enroll with the Ivy University Literature Department? No, I've never had an interest in going to a big university like that. My training is all the education I need. I see. But once in a while, when I get the chance, I make a trip to the nearby town. I can use a computer and a cell phone, too. That's not exactly something worth bragging about. <laughs> but I, I don't see any psyche locks. So she's not lying. That means she's not lying. That's interesting. So she's not Dahlia? Please don't stare at me like that. Please don't stare at me like that, senpai. How old is she? A nun at Hazekuri Temple. She reminds me so much of her. Nick. Oh, they don't, they don't even show Nick's profile. They used to show him in the, uh, his own profile back in the day. In the earlier games. Better known as Larry Butts. Current? Current in training. Current in tra Currently in training. Okay. Froze is a huge fan. Hazikuri Temple. What kind of place is this anyway? Isn't Iris? Isn't that the name of some god? I, I Some goddess? I completely forgot. The only reason why I remember Iris is because Iris is completely broken golden sun. I think it attacked the enemy and then it healed your allies. Iris was so broke. Anyway, I heard it's for training to increase your spiritual power or something. Must seem awfully crazy to normal people like you. Well, I have to admit it is a whole different world up here. I'm just glad to hear you say that. Huh? Talking with dead people, who does it help anyway? You hate it, huh? Really? So then why stay in a place like this? Oh! Is something wrong? I didn't realize it was so late. I have to go and ring the bell for lights out. I guess it's almost 10 now, huh? Um, uh, Mr. Wright? Yeah? If it's alright with you, I'd like you to have this. Really? But this is your hood! It has the power to protect you from evil spirits. Come to think of it, Sister Bikini was wearing one of these too. I pray for your safety on this dark, cold night. Iris Hood, received from Iris. I'm sorry, but I must bid you good night. Good day. Wait a minute, Sister Iris. Just now, you called me by my name. You said Mr. Wright. How did you know my name? I never introduced myself to you. Dun, 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 that's... Sister Iris, please tell me the truth. You and I, have we ever met before? Oh, that serious look. Oh, no! Damn! Iris, this can't be happening. <laughs> someone, someone, who the hell is Zero? Get Zero. With Zero when you need him. Perhaps we can speak again tomorrow. Damn. Those psyche locks came out in full force. Gong. Gong. Three gongs. So my hunch was correct. She does know me. I'll have to try to talk with her again tomorrow. Whoa! What the hell? The blood curdling scream came from the courtyard. Bu -bu 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 February 7th, 11.06 p.m. Hazikuri Temple Courtyard. I scream. I'm sure it came from somewhere around here. Someone's there! On the ground? Miss Datum! I just stepped on something soft. Hey, <laughs> don't step on my tummy like that. Oops! What? What are you even doing there in the snow? She was passed out. So that blood curdling. Oh, forget about that. Hurry up and call the police. Is there even a phone in the main hall? No, but we still get reception up here in the mountains. You must have a cell phone on you, right? I uh, didn't bring it with me. Oh, you're useless. I mean, even Iris has a cell phone. We got no choice. <laughs> you have to use the public phone by Dusky Bridge. Oh no, we gotta cross the bridge. Oh my god, if you don't hurry, Iris will... Iris will... 
Iris will what? February 7th, 11, 18 p.m. Dusky Bridge. It's farther than I thought. The bridge is just up ahead. I have to go tell Maya about what happened. Oh my god, the bridge is on fire! It's burning down! What the hell happened? What are you doing here? What are you even smiling about? What the hell? What is it? Is it me? Don't scare me like that, Larry. I almost had a heart attack. My name isn't Larry, it's Larice. <laughs> Larry, hurry up and go call the police! Don't be stupid, that bridge is nothing but a burning wreck now. Listen to me, there's been a murder here at Hazakuri Temple. What are you talking about? The murderer might have fled across the bridge. I have to make sure Maya is safe. Please call the police, Larry. I gotta go. Get out of my way. It's too dangerous. Nick! <laughs> I must have been crazy. I knew how dangerous it was, but I still went for it. I still went for it. The edge grab. Whoa, butts! Thinking even more about the fire, the wrinkly old bridge plank snapped and gave way. And I was swallowed by the internal darkness that surrounded me. And a final terrified scream rose up to pierce the frozen air of the harrowing night. He fell into the lake? Wow! Get out of here. So that's what... So the last case was him in the hospital from that fall from the bridge. Alright. I see you. I see you. Alright, so we're going to save our game here. We're going to take a break and uh, I'll see you guys next week for more Phoenix Wright action.